What's up, YouTube? YTPC? I'm gonna try to make this quick because it is like freaking hot out here. Uh, housekeeping. Drinking my Samuel Adams Oktoberfest. And it's cold. For Cobb Tuesday, my JWK2366 Camp Cobb. With almost the last of my Solani aged to burly flake. About all I got about one, maybe two bowls left of that. It was a sample I got from that pipe show. Uh, Kershaw. That was that sucked. But anyways, we had a Yabo. So uh For the weekend, uh, smokingpipes.com had 15% off. So, there was some uh, tobacco blends that I needed. And something I want to try, which I'll be doing a separate video for that. I don't think I cut enough of this. So, hope everybody had a good Labor Day weekend. I, uh... By choice, I worked yesterday. Um, I get my 12 hours of holiday pay, plus I got double time for the eight hours I worked. So there's a method to my madness there. Going away the weekend of the 14th, Friday and Saturday to a RC Semi and Construction Show. So anyways, we had a good weekend anyways. We did a lot of stuff Saturday and Sunday, and then I worked eight hours yesterday, so we did there. All right. Ooh, nice. Something smells cherry. What did I get that was cherry? Ah, one part of the mix. Uh, if I get this right, one, and then, and then not the one I think it's uh, BCA. If I have this right, and I hope I do. Oh, uh, I got a sample of Hobbit's weed from. I, I honestly, Ben the Bag Piper, that could have come from you. I'm not sure. Loved it. Um, I don't remember how many bowls I got out of it, but that stuff was great. And on one of the, I, I don't remember if it was Instagram or uh, Facebook pipe uh, forums, but uh, they posted a, a recipe for Hobbit's weed, um, and I don't remember like what the the brand or you know who, who come up with the recipe of it but if I pull these out and get this right it's and I'm gonna do it I did it in like e equal ounces so it's two parts of lane limited BCA so I lo love these bags how they had to do that but so I got two ounces of BCA so there's my two parts of BCA and one ounce of Lane Limited Very Cherry. I hope I have this right. I believe it's one part of the Sutleff 1M. So I got an ounce of the Sutleff 1M. That should be, if I have this correct, and somehow I'll put in the comments later if I screwed this up. But There's your recipe for Hobbit's Weed. Two parts, one part, one part. Now, I'm going to research it just a little bit before I do this, but I saw, I think it was on that post, uh, you know, I'm just going to take a, a bowl or something, or maybe a gallon bag, and I'm going to mix all this up. But somebody went further and asked uh, whoever, the guy that posted it, if uh, he mixed it all up and then tried pressing it and let it, cure you know pressed I'm guessing for weeks I don't know so I got to thinking and I didn't stop tonight although I knew I was gonna have this uh, I'm gonna research it and then stop uh, Dollar General it's right around the corner from me we got a new one here in our big metropolis so I think if I mix this stuff up and I get myself two like like bread steel metal bread pans and I don't know maybe somebody can comment and help me uh, maybe line it with uh, 
either wax paper or saran wrap first. I have my three mixtures mixed up, put it down in there, and I don't know, maybe put another layer of saran wrap, guys, and then put the other bread pan in it, and then clamp it, you know, as a press, make a tobacco press. And I've seen people make tobacco presses like that. Or they'll put them in PVC tubes and they clamp them, uh, whatever, however it works. But I think I might do that, because I'm in no hurry. I'm out of it, but I want to do this right, and I'll have, you know, four ounces of the stuff to put in a jar. But I think versus just mixing it up and throwing it in a jar, I think I want to mix it up and press it and see how that lets everything run. So, so that's a project, and I'm probably going to do a video on that when I do that. What else do we have? Oh, lane 1Q, because you can never have enough 1Q, and I was getting low, so two ounces of that. Lane RLP6, uh, another, I think this was on a YouTube, one of the YouTube, or uh, I'm sorry, uh, Facebook uh, groups, when they were picking out, you know, good tobaccos. I've never tried the L -E -P -L RLP6, and they say it's great, so I got two ounces of it. And like I said, it had 15% off, so, you know, it, it was worth going a little extra here. And these, well, this one, a real good one, actually. From that pipe show, when I told you I could do the tickets and get the samples, uh, I got Peter Stokeby Luxury Navy Flake. Love it. Love the stuff. Uh, I have a little jar of it still. You know how they said that was like an ounce sample? I, you know, give or take. So, I think I've had a couple bowls out of that, but... Uh, so I, I got two ounces of that because that, that shit's just good. I, I'm loving, I, I love that Navy, luxury Navy flake. And in with that, I have read that Peter Stokeby's luxury bullseye flake is a good one too. So I got two ounces of that. And I've not had any of that to my knowledge. I don't think I have a sample anywhere. So I don't think I've had that, but... Yeah, I, if it's anything, you know, near as good as the Luxury Navy Flake, I'm going to like it. So that was it. I said I'd do a quick yabo. Uh, turn your pipes into cash. Store credit. Eh, I don't need any to get rid of. So that's that. I said I just want to do a quick video. Hope everybody had a good uh, Labor Day weekend. And like I said, I'll do, uh, I'll do another video. I'll research this a little better to see if I, in fact, should press this and, uh, I guess, make a cake out of it and then break it up and put it in a jar. Is that what you would do? Um, you guys can comment on there if somebody knows that's what you do with it, but I'm going to try that. My 1Q, fill my jar back up. Be all good there. So, anyways, I won't bore you guys with uh, a lengthy video. I'll, uh, Finish this fine uh, solony here. Solony. I don't know how you say that. And then uh, I'm going to get back in the house in the uh, half air conditioning, half fan. So uh, we'll catch you guys later.